Congressman Charles Bustani of Louisiana is a member of the House and Ways and Means Committee and himself a doctor. He joins us now. Congressman, thanks for joining Brian, us. Brian, really good to be with you. Well, look, uh, health care is broken. We all know it's broken. I mean, right. I mean, we hear these stories about how difficult it is for elderly people to find doctors. Uh, and we need to fix it, but this plan seems to have its own set of problems in that it's very expensive. Well, it is very expensive, and we're just starting to see what the real expense of the plan is going to be. CBO, uh, the Congressional Budget Office, had really not scored this, had not looked at what the cost was going to be in terms of deficits. Uh, just today, they released some preliminary figures showing a deficit of over $230 billion dollars. And this is an incomplete estimate, so we think it's going to be actually much higher than well, that. Well, so what's going to happen here? I mean, uh, the president says, we will do this, we will do it this year, and we're going to do it and keep it within the budget. We're not going to run up the deficit with this plan. How do you do all that? Well, certainly what he said is uh, counter to what this Rep House Republican plan, or House Democrat plan looks like, I should say. This passed in the Ways and Means Committee uh, in the wee hours Friday morning. We have to start over. We Republicans have some very good ideas on how we can target solutions to the uninsured, how we can keep the cost down, and, uh, and enhance quality and preserve the doctor-patient relationship in the process. Congressman, uh, you're a Republican in a democratically controlled institution. Are they listening to Republican ideas right now? It doesn't seem to me that I see much of that going on. Well, there's an interesting development occurring behind the scenes right now whereby some of the moderate Democrats, the so-called blue dog Demo uh, Democrats, and, and business-friendly uh, new Democrats are actually starting to have conversations with us to build a coalition from the center outward to actually really come up with substantive and well-founded health care reform. And that's the only way to do this. Yeah, but your, your Speaker of the House is not a blue dog Democrat. I know that. And that's the problem. But we think that if uh, we can build enough public opinion on this, it will force the issue because the American public wants health care reform. Republicans agree that it needs to be done, but it has to be done carefully and in a prudent way that doesn't disrupt the whole system. Well, Congressman Charles Bustany, thank you very much for joining us here. Brian, really good to be I here. I think everybody wants to see some success here. We're just not sure how we're going to get there just yet. Thank you for joining us.